Well, the Braves aren't going to go 162-0. Dang, that's unfortunate. We're trying to be the first team to ever do that. But you know what Brian Snicker says, always win the series. And that's what we did. And we made a statement in doing so. Two laughers um, to start the season. Got to feel good in enemy territory. And that budding rivalry, that is the Phillies. Um, so feeling really good regardless. Um, just a really unlucky, annoying type of seventh inning that got away from us. Uh, but it always starts with a leadoff walk. So don't let uh, Jimenez off the hook um, just as much as Aaron Bummer. You don't like leadoff walks, especially to the powerful Phillies that they are. We didn't really solve Ranger Suarez today either, but we got um, his pitch count up with with deep counts, even though he had seven strikeouts. Um, but the umpire was not consistent at all, and I think that played into about probably four or five of our strikeouts that could have been um, switch switch the momentum. Um, but Carvin Coffey started lead off Eagle. I walked by Ronald. Wizard of Oz, Oz has got the power stroke today, had uh, three RBIs, and he's got the power stroke to start the season, excuse me, 2-0, uh, and then unfortunately for Chris Sale, second pitch in a Braves uniform was deposited, just a meatball fastball by um, Sale and Schwarber, crushed it 2-1, and then he was able to settle in super, super nicely. Um, and then we were able to add on in the fourth with a leadoff double by Riley. And then a two-out RBI single. Tried to stretch it into a double, even though uh, I don't know how there was enough evidence to overturn the safe call. But it's us against replay, so you know how that goes. But the run still scored, 3-1. And then the big bugaboo inning for Chris Sale was the fifth. Um, a duck sort single by... Sosa, and then a walk to Christian Pache, and a yank slider into the shin of Rojas. Bases loaded, no outs, and he was able to uh, gut up and throw one of the best sliders he threw all day to Kraus Schorber, got him leaning, pitcher's best friend twin killing, and then was able to get Trey Turner uh, swinging on 96 gas face. Louisiana right by you um, to limit the damage to the one run on the double play. So 3-2. And then uh, the seventh is where it uh, became a bummer. And that a pun intended there. But let's not forget that Bryson Stott has the most annoying walk-up song and earned a walk. Um, there Again, those were close pitches that the umpire had called at some points. And Jimenez didn't get them. Um, um, so leadoff walk. And then you got the stable lefties coming up for the Phillies. So then you go to Bummer. He's able to strike out Marsh. Um, and then get a ground ball off the bat of Rojas. Unfortunately, Rojas is fast. And Ozzy took a millisecond too long. And we couldn't complete the double play. As rightly called on replay. But... Dang! And then um, Kyle Schwarber ambush mode, first pitch, um, breaking ball, just meatball, trying to get over strike, I think, and file this away. Schwarber has been aggressive on the first pitch, so file that away for uh, later on this season because uh, he typically isn't that aggressive on the first pitch, but he had been this series, uh, single up the middle, and then got. Quickly, quickly, 0-2 to Trey Turner and just left a fastball, 94. And that shift that hole was wide open. And Trey Turner hadn't really done anything against us this series, but it's Trey Turner against the Braves. You knew he was going to bite us at some point. 3-2-3. Um, three, three, and then, um, but it was just such a bad 0-2 execution pitch. He could have gone so many different directions. Dirt ball, uh, you, you had so much at your disposal and trying to go fastball in and left it over. I, I wish he would have gone breaking ball there, but obviously hindsight's a thousand. And then they stole, so second and third, two outs. Um, Alec Bohm hits a fister, and Adam Duvall could not get it. 
it just another duck snort that fell in front of Adam Duvall. Really good effort. Nothing he could do uh, to make it 5-3. And then he was able to get Nick Castellanos to ground out to end that mess. Uh, and then we were able to uh, scratch a clock across the run. Jared Kelnick, really amazing at bat. Um, fell behind two strikes quickly and then stroked the double into the gap. And then Ozzy with two outs after Ronald struck out 3-2 on a 3-2 nasty pitch um, by Dominguez. It would it would have been a it would have been a walk, but it was a nasty pitch. Um, Ozzy was able to lace a single, make it 5-4, and then Matt Olson against Gregory Soto, lefty lefty just just missed first pitch fastball. I mean just missed it, got under it for a fly out to end. Um, in that threat, and then um, it should have been a walk to Adam Duvall, but it ended up being a uh, easy strikeout to Ozuna to start the inning, and then a the flyout to Adam Duvall, even though on a 3-2 count, and then uh, Michael Harris lined it uh, to Nick Castellanos in in the game. Just some just some pitches that didn't go our way, not executing on two strikes, and this. Much of a uh, bobble or a millisecond wait, and we would have been out of that seventh inning and still had the lead and maybe something, and maybe been in the win column. But that's baseball for you. As always, go Braves, champions forever. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Helps out a lot. Thanks, guys.